our sugar daddy came through and got us a private tour. You know, it's only us, nobody else. We're getting ready for our second day here. And the weather, it's still bipolar as so fuck. My skin feels a nasty, like I'm breaking out from how nasty the air is here. So for today, our itinerary changed once again. So basically we're taking a tour around New York City and we're gonna do all the, whatchamacallit, touristy stuff today. I'm tired, my skin looks like shit. So right now we're walking to Central Park. We are gonna get on the bus tours and that is the closest stop to us so we won't have to walk that far. We're currently on the tour bus. We don't know where we're going, but that's fine. It's pretty cool. So we ended up getting on the wrong tour bus, and that one was going to Harlem, and we're trying to go to Uptown, because I want to go to the Met. And right now we are walking two blocks down to go on the tour bus that's gonna take us Uptown. Luckily, we figured it out before the bus left, or else we would have been stuck on a tour to Harlem. So we ran into a dilemma. So my dumbass accidentally dropped my ticket to board the bus. And I have to email customer service because the manager of the bus allowed me to get on this bus. Well, we're not on it yet, but like he's letting me board on the bus, but he told me that if I try to get, if I do get off of the bus or any of the stops to get back on, it's gonna be difficult for me to get on. So now I'm literally just waiting for customer service to reply back to me with an email so I'm allowed to board on the buses. But I think they're fixing something. I'm not quite sure yet. But we're in this cute little spot waiting. And we'll see. We'll see if customer service reaches back out to me or I'm just gonna be stuck in the middle of nowhere. So. Where I'm gonna be stuck in the middle of nowhere. So we're getting on the bus. Tour bus. Ooh, low key. We're gonna start the tour and customer service still hasn't replied back to me, but he said that it should take within 30 minutes. So, you know, um, our sugar daddy came through and got us a private tour. You know, it's only us, nobody else on the tour because Private tours are the way to go. I finally got the confirmation email for my ticket. They were rude as fuck, but still got it. So we got off for the Rockefeller, and we're gonna go up and see, I guess. And then after this, we're gonna head to the Met to take some pictures, because you know, we're some Gossip Girl fans here, so you know, we get a XOXO Gossip Girl. I still haven't ate day two without eating, I guess. You ate yesterday. Well, I ate yesterday. I ate one meal, but I haven't ate today, which kind of sucks because I'm getting kind of hungry and I'm getting kind of lightheaded, but I feel like I just need to drink a Powerade and I'll be good to go. So someone just asked for directions and I guess we know where we're going now. She's wearing heels and she's complaining. Why are you complaining? <laughs> <laughs> She's a natural blonde. So we're waiting in line. So now I don't know exactly what we're doing. Um, they just keep sending us places. So I don't know. I don't know if we're gonna go up now or we'll have to wait for our time. So we're no longer going up to the Rockefeller because. So within the 10 minutes that we were in line, the time went from going up at 6 o'clock to 9 p.m. So it literally went up 3 hours and 10 minutes, so it's not really not worth it. So now we're leaving back. Uh, we're going to try to go back to the bus tour where we were dropped off. So that's quite a walk there. And I don't know where we're going from this, but it should be fun, you know, going with the flow. My feet are starting to hurt, but we're going to suck it up because we're not going to so we're just going to suck the shit up. I'm gonna be honest with you guys, I have no fucking clue where we're at. 
Like, I think we're lost. We're lost in New York, clickbait. We're stopping at H&M because someone couldn't handle wearing the shoes they were wearing, so they have to buy new shoes. It is currently 5 o'clock. I still haven't had a single meal. Day 2, <laughs> at it again. But we need to stay hydrated, so we're gonna go into a Starbucks right before we go to the stop to get picked up. And I'm gonna get a water to stay hydrated because number one thing. Um, we made a quick stop. She got a brownie. I got a pink drink with some almond milk because it's always better with almond milk. And we got some water to stay, hy to stay hydrated. So we made it to the Met and I'm a little upset because everything's closed off as you can see which is very depressing but they're getting it all ready for the Met Gala which is on Monday and today is Saturday so we're not going to be able to take our iconic picture that we wanted our, I'm Blair, very, Waldorf. our Blair Waldorf moment taken from us because of the Met Gala when we come back next time we'll be invited to the Met Gala yeah next time we'll be invited to the Met Gala I'm very upset that's what I was looking forward to. We're currently inside the Met. We're a little upset because everything was closed, so we lost a little moment, but we're gonna look at some art now. So we ended up getting off of the tour bus, and now we are walking back down Times Square because we're gonna go eat pizza because at a pizza place that Jasmine found that apparently it's like the best pizza in New York I didn't say it's the best, but we said it's good People say it's really good, so we're gonna go down and eat some pizza and then from there we're gonna go to the Empire State Building This is the best view we've gotten so far. <laughs> kind of. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Ah, my hands are like. <laughs> Now we're walking seven floors down because the wait time to get on the elevator down was seven minutes, 40 minutes. So it was 40 minutes. We we're gonna walk down the stairs for probably like seven minutes tops, or actually like two minutes tops. So. so now we're walking back to the hotel, but I'm debating if I should call an Uber because the hotel's a mile away, which is not a lot. But the Uber's like $20 for a mile. Like, that's fucking crazy. So, I don't know, we might walk, we might call Uber, we'll see, depending on how bad my feet hurt. But does Broadway only go one way? 
No, it goes both ways, huh? It goes both ways. Okay. So we'll see when we get closer if it's we can handle or not. We'll find out. I just want to wash my face. My face feels disgusting. We finally made it back to the hotel. <gasps> my, <laughs> my body hurts. Everything hurts. I'm extremely exhausted. Today has felt like such a long day. Even though our day started like at... Two. two, right? Our day started at 2 o'clock. It's barely 10. And it has felt like the longest day of my life. The battery's gonna die. We just gotta make it to the room and take a nap because I am exhausted. <laughs> so it's a lot later. It's 10.43 here at in New York. My skin feels horrible. Like, I'm looking at it right now and I'm like, holy shit. Like, my skin's it's just not doing well here in New York. Like, it was doing so well right before I got here. And I got here, been here for a day. And it's having a fucking mental breakdown. So yeah, so this is the end for day two. We still have a full day tomorrow and then we fly back on Monday. So I'm gonna end today's vlog here. Goodbye. <laughs> Da 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 da